Hello everyone and welcome back to another video brought to you by SeniorCatWellness.com. If you enjoy today's presentation and find it informative, please feel free to subscribe to this channel, like the video, and share the content. Today's video subject, why do cats paw pads change color? Before we begin, let's first take a look at today's topic overview. The most common reason why paw pads change color is injury. This could be due to stepping on a sharp piece of glass, being bitten by an insect, burns, and ingrown claws. Other reasons for sudden changes in paw pad color include vitiligo, plasma cell pododermatitis, and anemia. Sudden and drastic changes to your cat's paw pads should be checked by a professional as soon as possible. While slight discoloration to just one paw pad could suggest a less serious condition, stark color changes to all paw pads, especially that of paleness, could indicate a serious medical issue. While the color of a cat's paw pads will naturally change from pink to a darker gray or black simply due to the aging process and general pad usage through walking and running, color changes in an adult feline can potentially be a sign of a problem. And while cracking is common, especially due to slight injury and environmental conditions, be mindful of color changes that happen suddenly. And let's get right to it, today's core topic. As for the why factors, we offer the following notable causes. We'll start with vitiligo, hallmarked by the loss of pigment in the skin. The condition known as vitiligo can cause a feline's paw pads to slowly lose color, essentially turning an adult cat's black paw pads into a pale pink or white. And although vitiligo is a bit rare and is only cosmetic, it can impact other areas of a cat's body, such as the mouth and the nose. And yes, to mention what some of you are probably thinking, vitiligo is often associated, at least in pop culture, with the late Michael Jackson, with signs of the condition observed by Jackson's dermatologist coming as early as 1983. Next is the hereditary aspect of things. There are breeds such as the Siamese, where vitiligo has been observed. It is believed that stricken breeds could have a gene that could trigger vitiligo. In some cases, the skin condition can turn cats completely white. And while felines could pass the gene to their offspring, it is not guaranteed. It should be noted that the exact cause of vitiligo without dispute is unknown. This goes for cats and humans. Next, we have autoimmune diseases. When a cat's immune system begins to attack the body, the result can include changing of paw pad color or an absence of color. And yes, so far, the topic of the day, vitiligo can be the result. Stress has long since been associated with a potential cause of vitiligo in addition to exposure to toxins and neurological diseases. Often developing at a young age, vitiligo will typically first appear on the face and the nose before spreading to other areas of the body, including the paw pads. Next, we have plasma cell pododermatitis, hallmarked by inflammation with the paw pads taking on a purplish tint. The condition known as plasma cell dermatitis is caused by what is often an underlying health condition that promotes a negative reaction. Another name for the condition is known as pillow foot, as a cat's inflamed paw will often look like a pillow. In addition to a purplish tint, a cat's paw pad can appear mushy, almost as though it lacks structure. It can form the aforementioned pillow shape, and it can often affect more than one paw. Diagnosis of this condition is achieved through a blood test with antibiotics as a common remedy. Next, we have anemia. Your cat's paw pads have turned white and have done so rather suddenly. Your cat could be suffering from anemia. This is a condition hallmarked by the loss of red blood cells. Weakness, lethargy, and loss of appetite are the trio of notable symptoms in addition to paw pad discoloration. Exposure to toxins, the presence of infection, hypophosphanemia, insufficient phosphates in the blood, nutritional deficiencies, and bone marrow disease are all potential health issues that can be responsible for anemia. And finally, we have paw pad injuries. Injury can cause the discoloration of your cat's paw pads for a time, especially if the paw in question has sustained some type of cut, burn, or puncture wound. 
Generally, the paw will regain its normal color once the injury heals. Contact with rough surfaces and bites are just two of the most common causes of paw pad injuries. And not to play the role of Debbie Downer, but if you own a cat long enough, they will inevitably suffer some type of pad trauma in this fashion. Let's not forget, felines are doing this whole life thing without sneakers. If you would like more information concerning today's subject matter, please click the initial link in the description box below and join us at SeniorCatWellness.com. And once again, feel free to like and share this video and subscribe to the channel if this type of content is of interest to you. Thanks for watching, and we'll talk to you later.